guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. And today I have a quick just vacay makeup tutorial. So this is actually the makeup you guys are going to learn how to do. It's super quick and easy. It's basically what I did while I was at the cruise. I just went to a cruise and it was one of the most memorable experiences, something that I'm definitely going to always remember. And I'm going to just share with you guys the kind of makeup that I did and the products that I used and what I took with me. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's just get started. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys a makeup look that I did while I was on the cruise and honestly I'm going to show you guys my go-to. I will show you guys the foundation that I did take with me and this is the Cover FX. Actually, I'll just use this. So, I my like to prep my skin. I just use my skincare products, and you guys already know. So I traveled with a bag like this, and in here I had my Clinique moisturizer, and I had everything else, like my toner and everything. But I did take my facial spray by Mario Badescu just because I had that in the travel size, and my Pep Start eye under eye and the turnaround oil just because I knew that if I wanted a little bit more of that glow then I would definitely just do the oil so I already have moisturizer on I'm gonna put some eye cream this is the pep start it's just supposed to help with uh, puffiness and just to brighten your eyes and it works really really well as a primer so as you guys can see I got a little bit of tan and I got my freckles my freckles came out well, I'm going to go ahead and use a little bit of the turnaround oil. And this oil is just going to give me some glow. I'm going to go ahead and just take it with my fingers. And I'm just going to kind of pat it on. Right, so now that I have that nice glowy skin, I'm going to go ahead and apply my foundation. Now you can do this or what I did was just use my concealer and just my um, bronzer. That's all. So if you guys want to do that, you guys can do that and just bronze up the skin. But I'm going to go ahead and just put a little bit of this on. And this was not for like every day. I would just do this like if I was going to go to dinner and honestly this is how I did it so I would just put it on with my fingers bring it up to the under eye and kind of just melt it in with my fingers put it over the nose oh my god guys I had some breakouts I had got gotten waxed um and I got really bad breakouts in my back because I got my bag waxed I'm a very hairy person, and I have my lower back gets like hairy. It's too much information, but it's the truth. <laughs> oh my god, you guys can hear my dog. Um, all right, so just blending this, I'm gonna blend a little bit over here. As you guys can see, I didn't even use a lot. I'm just gonna go ahead and just really blend this in here. The breakouts were worse during the whole cruise, but I had to deal with it too bad. Alright, so after I did that, I went ahead and used... Oh my god. Get out of here! So I definitely challenged myself, and I added these two in there just because I know I needed them. But, I'm going to show you guys how I use this huge one with everything. So, I took my Derma Blend powder after. I like to always put some on the cap and just swirl it, kind of like the bare minerals way. Swirl it, cut the excess off, and then I would just dust it all over like this. We have to add our tan back on just because I'm very like crazy like that. So I took my Give Me Sun bronzer with the same brush, tap the excess off, and then I just went in added that to this part and I just blended it down a little bit turn it up a little and the thing is like with bronzer you can go crazy with this just because you are already bronzed so it's not going to look bad 
the access off. And just use this, kind of like if you're contouring type of thing. And then the good thing is that if you feel like it's like too much, you can always go back in with your setting powder, take some, and then just go over and kind of like bring it down a little bit. I like to put some over my nose. So I'm going to go back in with my... So there's some over the nose just because I am tan there. And then just a little bit in the eye right here. Make sure we got the forehead. And then just the chin and everything else. Alright. For blush, I also used my, this fluffy brush. I know I'm crazy. But it, honestly, to be honest, on a cruise, like, you never really do your makeup a lot. Like, I only did it, like, once or twice. That's it. Maybe it's just me. But maybe it's just me. Alright, and I went ahead. Oh, damn. I, I just realized I didn't even put concealer on. But this is, like, r real, like, stuff right here. I'm not making this up. So... So I went ahead and did that, put blush on, and then I'm going to go ahead and put highlights. So I like to use my Japanese brush for that. So I'm going to take my Gilded Honey, and I'm going to just put it just so I can give my skin that nice highlight and like glow. Um, I didn't go really crazy with this, to be honest. Um... When it came to doing my makeup for the dinners, oh my god, I'm going to show you guys pictures. Just because as the days went on, the more kind of like tan I got. But I didn't get like super tan, but you know, I, my skin got a little bit of color, so it was a little hard to kind of not look, I don't know, white, I want to say, in pictures. But this definitely won't make you look white because I'll show, like, the the second picture we took at that dinner, because they always take pictures every night, I did not look white. I was like, oh, thank God. That's, like, my biggest fear. Now I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. And honestly, this is, like, oh, my God, a lifesaver just because it already has, like, the angle to it. So it kind of shapes your brows really easily. Look at that. Damn. Oh, how I love this one. And this is a benefit one. I was like gonna get a different one. And this is only 20 bu 12 bucks. The other one, the bigger one, is 24. So I was like, oh my god, why am I gonna spend so much on a trip? And thank god they had this because I was able to test it out. But honestly, this is what I would do when I would go to the beach, or I mean the pool. I would do my brows sometimes and then just do my mascara. And that was it. So next is just my waterproof mascara. But I'm not going to put it on and I'll tell you guys in a second why. So I'm going to go ahead and just put a little bit of the Monsieur. Oh my god, this is the lip that I used all the time. The Marc Jacobs or lip balm. And that was the finished look. That's what I did. Now, if you guys want to go in, put a little shadow or anything like that, one thing that I did one of the nights, use your bronzer. Let's say you don't have eyeshadows. Use your bronzer, a nice fluffy brush, and just use that in the crease and just kind of blend it out. And it already gives you some kind of, like, De not not def definition, but like dimension. It'll give you some color and the crease and a little depth. It looks so pretty. And then it goes with your overall glow. So that's the finish look. I can't show you guys what a beat face would look like because I didn't beat my face for the cruise just because I don't like the feeling of being like by the water and just having like tons of makeup on I'm more of that like natural kind of person when it's time to put tons of makeup on I will but when it's like stuff like this I just like to use the least amount of products and just get like a nice glow and that's it so I'll tell you guys what happened with this 
So I, lo I do love Too Faced. Less Too Faced uh, cosmetics. Let's not get that wrong, because I have other stuff of theirs, like their uh, liquid lipsticks and one of their bronzers that I love so much. And I have multiple other things that I love from them, but for some reason, this right here, the waterproof mascara just did not work for me. I actually went into the, um, into the, like, ocean with it, and maybe it was because of the salt. I don't know. Uh, let me know if you guys had the same problem, but my eyes were burning and when i say burning i mean like like it works like it doesn't come off or anything but my eyes were burning and i didn't like the feeling of that and it was just very uncomfortable so that was my experience with it sorry i wish it worked but it didn't work for me all right so i hope you guys enjoyed this quick like makeup like for traveling especially if you're on a cruise kind of look and I hope that you guys enjoy it and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.